right, we are in the Bronx, and we are going to Collector's Cave. It's supposed to be a pretty cool spot. Uh, lots of collectibles and toys, but also comic books. So we'll go check it out, get a little store review here, and we'll check out this uh, block here. Look at this beautiful Christmas tree here. This thing is huge. Look at this tree. It is ginormous. The tree is larger than the guy's house. It's like Rockefeller Center in the Bronx. Look at this. He is in the Christmas spirit. And we are on the corner of Hobart Avenue and Middletown Road. And we are in the Bronx. And we are going to do a tour of this open van here. We're going to walk right in there and tour the open van. No, we're not. We're going to go to the collector's cave here. We're going to do a store tour. And here comes a fan out with his scooter. Got his pull list. He's exiting. And this is collector's cave. And uh, let's check out their display here. Very impressive. They have Luffy, One Piece, Captain America. A nice display out front. I know they have a big online presence. I think they do a lot of work that way. And this is their storefront, their outlet. If you want to come in, that Batman is terrific. And I'm excited to go in here and check out this place. I want to grab some books. There was a specific book I wanted. And I looked for a comic shop in the area to come by and get the specific... You ready to go in? Let's go. Let's go in. How you doing? How's it going? All right. We might have to just show them that. If you need help with anything, let me know. Sure. I thought I was just... I just got employed. He came at me with the clipboard. I thought he just hired me as the staff here. And I was about to move some boxes. I thought I just got a job. All right. Like and subscribe if you like the content here. It helps out the channel. Ring the bell to get notified of new videos. And these are all the new books here, and they got a lot of back issues here. And look at all that Funko Pop. It is a dam, a dam of Funko Pop. The dam is about to break. It won't hold. It won't hold, sir. <laughs>
Dark Knights of Steel, right? It's a variant cover. And is that Voltron? All right, so we have some back issues too. Maybe we'll go through some back issues. Look at this. And this book is hot. Primordial is getting great reviews. I already have it though. I don't think I need another copy of that, right? Ooh, look at the honey. All right, I was gonna, they also have some collections up here. I love sets. They have the Umbrella Academy, the whole set. But I don't know. It was 130 bucks. That's kind of steep. I don't know. It's kind of high, right? Let me put that one back. All right, and a crowd is coming in. It's new comic book day. So people are pouring in. And it's getting crowded here. Let me blast through some detective comics here. Let's see if I catch anything interesting. I got some Star Wars. All right, they have a cool wall. Some cool books on there. And they have a spinner rack. All right, let's go to the new books here. We have... Oh, Devil's Reign is out. I forgot all about that. Chip Zdarsky has a new run out. I should have grabbed that, right? I forgot all about it. And what is this Batman 118? What is this sign here? What is happening? Is there a conspiracy? They're selling out? <laughs> All right, that sign, that sign just gave me FOMO. It makes me want to grab it now. I can't believe this is selling out. I had no idea what was going on. I wasn't paying attention. I know a new writer is coming on the title, right? Joshua Williamson. Oh, that cover A is awesome. It's cover A. I know the new writer on there, maybe new energy to the book, but I don't know what the, all the fanfare is about. I think maybe there was going to be a new villain or something. But it looks like this book is selling out, so go to your local LCS and grab them before they're gone. I'll grab cover A and maybe a variant. And uh, there's a bunch of other books I wasn't aware of. I didn't come in here for that book, I came in with something else. But these are all the new releases, we got a new Star Wars book. Looks like uh, there was a new crossover book. Yeah. Walking Dead book. The deluxe edition. Oh, this is top five of the year, right? These Batman Zero Points. This book was awesome. I did a review on my channel. Check it out. Ooh. And then we got some Batman Beyond. Oh, look at these. Great covers. Let me look for number 50. In the Rebirth, I love that run, but I missed the last issue. It's 49. Oh, then it ends. That's weird, right? The first issue and the last issue. Sometimes the last issue is hard to find. Oh, come on. Civil War, you're using the title to sell books. That's not a Civil War book. Come on. War crimes. Weak. <laughs> Deceased, that was awesome. Dead Planet, all the spinoffs were great. The Tom Taylor book, he's killing it. All right, they have some more collectibles in here, statues, and a Star Wars book here. All right, and there's a ton of people working in the store here. I think they do a lot of work online. So I think they're getting ready to ship and box stuff out. And we have a bunch of dollar books here on the bottom. If you want to just fill in some holes, grab some dollar books. Very cool, right? All right, so let me grab my comics here and go to the front. I didn't grab that many. Oh, there's one piece. Get a little, uh... I let me grab my books. I'll go to the front and pay for them. And then I'll show you what I got. If you want to stick around, I'll do a, uh, a little haul to show you what I got. Because there was an issue here I wanted to get, and nobody's talking about it. All right, let me go to the front and pay for these. I'll meet you outside. All right, just came out of Collector's Cave. It was a pretty cool shop. I grabbed some books. And if you want to check out my haul, uh, stay with me. I only got like four books, uh, new books. If you want, I'll uh, put a tack it on at the end. But I didn't go, uh, the, uh, they had a lot of variants and stuff on the wall, but uh, I just usually get new books. So uh, check me out, we'll uh, open them now.
All right, I grabbed the Dark Knights of Steel. This is the Tom Taylor miniseries. This is number two. Number one was pretty great, so I want to follow this definitely. And uh, this is going to be a good series. Looks like it's going to climax with Superman versus Batman. Batman's already been like removed from the uh, realm here. He's like an outsider. All right, and then the new Batman issue here, 118. What is going on with this? There was only two per customer. It looks like these issues are selling out. What is happening here? Let me know in the comments below. I guess Joshua Williamson is now on the run, and there's going to be new energy inserted into the uh, title card here. But I don't see, uh, and I guess a new villain, Abyss? But I didn't think there was going to be so much enthusiasm for this. These things are selling out. And I got cover A on the right, and I got a variant on the left. The uh, variant on the left is cardstock. So it's done uh, really well. And uh, all new collector's item. I fell right for that. FOMO. When it says collector's item on it, you know it's be worth nothing. But I grabbed it. All right, and I was working in the Bronx today. This is why I went into the uh, store. I was working in the Bronx today. I was looking for a comic book shop to grab this book. Because when I read my copy, Superman dies. Nobody's talking about this. The death of Superman. And today, I ran to the comic book store in the Bronx Collector's Cave to grab another copy. Uh, this uh, epic moment here, there's a Martian Manhunter backstory in the Death of Superman issue. And you guys aren't going to believe this. this is action-packed, this issue. And I can't believe it. 1938 to uh, 2021, Superman had a good run. Rest in peace, brother. Superman has been... Re Let's check out the artwork here. He is screaming, he is battling, he's fighting. And then, look at this. He got impaled. Soup is done. All right. I can't believe it. And you know what happens when a character in the comic books gets killed. They never come back. So this is it. So this is it. Maybe you guys should pick up this book here. No one's talking about it. The Death of Superman. It is like the 90s all over again. The 90s. The 90s. All right, thanks for watching. Check out my other videos. I'll see you next time.